Hi everyone, so today since we are celebrating Pride Month, I'm going to show you how to make this progressive pride flag painting. To read a little bit more about the flag and what it means, there's a link in the description of this video that will have all the information for you. So from the bag you'll need the paint, the blue, the black, the white, the two reds and the yellow, the styrofoam plate, the paintbrush, the ruler, and a canvas. The first thing that you're going to do is put the ruler vertically on the right side of the canvas and mark it at the 10, mark it at the 3.5, the 7, and then the 13.5 and the 17 so that you've created six equal parts. And then you're going to turn the ruler horizontally and make sure it's in the middle where you marked the 10 and you're going to mark it at the 12, the 10, the 8, the 6, and the 4, so that you've created 5 dots. You're going to turn your ruler vertically and mark in the corner, and then the 2 and the 4, and do that at the top, in the corner, and then the 2 and the 4, and then you're going to switch your ruler horizontally again and do the same thing. So you've already marked in the corner, so mark the 2 and the 4 at the top, and then along the bottom, the 2 and the 4 centimeters. I've marked it and put the centimeter so you can pause the video here and take a look if that's easier for you. Next you're going to connect the dots to make it look something like this. To do that you're going to connect the first dot in the middle and the first dot at the top. And then you're going to do the same thing so marking the farthest one in the middle and the farthest one on the bottom to make a triangle shape. And you're going to keep connecting the dots until you've made the outline of the flag. If it's easier, you can go back to where I showed the parts connected in the photo and pause the video and copy that. Once you're done, you're going to have created five little triangles along the left side of the painting. After that, you're going to connect the rest of the flag. So you're going to connect the outside of the triangle to the lines that we made at the very beginning. This will create six equal sections. Once you've completed that, now you have to paint. You're going to start with purple, blue, green, yellow, orange, red, and then black, brown, light blue, pink, and white, just to match this flag. To get all of the colors on the flag, you're going to have to mix some. I've created an outline here for your reference. Pause it to make sure you get the right mixtures. Then you can start to paint your flag. For best results, let it dry and give it a second coat. And it will look something like this. Thanks for watching and happy Pride Month from all of us here at NFCHC.